In this video, I'll be showing how to create and edit routes on the Map My Customers mobile app. Like many features in Map My Customers, routes can be created in a number of different locations within the app. You can either use the blue Open Routes button in that center of your screen there, or down across the bottom in that navigation bar, the third tab is to Routes. I'm going to click that blue Open Routes button in the center of my screen. As you can see on this page, routes can be created for both companies and for people. For the sake of this video, I'll be creating a company route. The list below is going to show you all the routes that have previously been created by this user. To create a new route, I'm going to hit that blue Add New Route button. From here, it's going to take me to the map. I'm going to want to create a route in New York City because that's where I am currently. So I'm just going to hit that blue filter button in the right hand side. I'm going to add the filter of state and I'm going to say contains New York. I'm going to apply that filter and now the only pins that exist on my map are in New York. So the easiest way to create a route is using that lasso tool. The lasso tool is located in the lower left-hand corner of the screen in that little black circle. I'm going to click on the lasso and it's going to pop up with the instructions for me. It says draw a shape around some pins and make sure there's less than 69 pins in a circle area. So what I'm going to do is just take my finger and drag around the screen and circle the pins that I'd like in my route. From here, I'm going to hit next in the upper right-hand corner and it's going to prompt me to build my route, including my starting, ending, and name features of the route. My starting location, I'm going to start from my current location. And so to grab my location, I'm just going to hit that little target on the right-hand side. I'm going to do the same for my ending location as well. You can either type in the office, your home address, anything like that, wherever you'd like to start and end your routes. For the route name, you can name it anything. It could be the day of the week, the city that you're located in. I'm just going to call this one Wednesday route. And then you just choose whether you'd like to optimize this route or run the route in order. I'm going to optimize it to make sure I'm hitting all those pins in the most efficient manner. You can also lot time per stop. This can be 15, 30, 45 minutes if you know that each stop is going to take you a certain period of time. And additionally, you can edit the start and the start time of this route. So if you're pre-planning or anything like that, you can shift this to 9 a.m. on tomorrow, anything like that, but I'm gonna keep it on today and we'll put it back. So now you're just going to build this route by hitting build route in the upper right-hand corner. And it's gonna show you that route for you. So it's going to show you the most optimized way to get to all of these pins. If you'd like to see the itinerary broken down by the names of the different pins, you'll just scroll down and you can see all of the different uh, stops that you're going to be hitting. You can also go in and edit things such as the time period. If I just know that the fire department of New York is going to take me 30 minutes or that Joseph is going to take me 45 minutes. From here, you haven't actually saved your route. It's very important that if you don't just route to the first stop on here, but that you hit save in the upper right hand corner as to save the progress you've made in creating this route. And that's going to be how you successfully create your route. Now I'm going to go in and show you the different ways to edit this route. One of the ways that you might want to edit the route is by adding an additional stop that you know is nearby. You can toggle on all the pins in the area by hitting show all pins in this little slider. It's going to then populate the pins that are not currently in the route, but do exist in the map. So I'd like to add this one down in East Village, this pin right here, which is hair of the dog. It is now highlighted green and I'm given the option to add to route. Very simply, I'm going to hit add to route. And once again, hit build route in the upper right hand corner and just save that route. And now that edit has been made for me, Hair of the Dog is now on my route, which I can see in my itinerary here. If you did want to edit anything here by time, so you know that Orbis said, actually, you need to hit me earlier in the day, what you're going to do is just hold down on Orbis and slide it to wherever it needs to go. You'll see that the time has not adjusted yet, but once you hit build route in the upper right hand corner, the times will adjust and it will give you the appropriate timed itinerary for when you're going to get to all your stops. Once again, I'm going to just hit save to make sure all my progress is saved. 
And that's how I can add and edit a route, a route by clicking a pin nearby. You can also edit the route by finding new leads in the area. What you're going to do is hit that blue find leads button and then search a keyword. I'd like to find a cardiologist near me. I can just search cardiologist in here and the map is going to populate with these red pins that are going to fall within this category. I can click around on the different pins and it will tell me what the name of the pin is. So say I'd like to add cardiology solutions to my route. I'm going to select it and then down at the bottom hit add to route. And now that pin has been added to my route as well. So that's how to find new leads, edit the route, and create a route in general.